Hi Earth Signs, I'm here to do um, a weekly reading for you from the 26th of April. It's Pink Vision Tarot here. It's a general reading, so it might resonate, it might not. Let's just see how we go. So Earth Signs, we just want to know what the messages might be for you for this week coming up. A heads up on anything. I'll do that one more time. Okay, first card. The sun. Wow. Okay, so fire signs had the sun in that spot, and air signs had the sun in exactly that spot. So, um, like I said to them, and you, you know, could be dealing with an air sign or a fire sign. Um, if not, uh, this is about coming out of isolation. So hopefully wherever you are in the world, you might be doing that, um, feeling better about yourself, um, feeling um, healthier. So if you've been sick, you might be starting to recover. If you've had surgery, it's about the sun coming out. And it's about, to me, looking at um, the arms open, it's about claiming your victory. So that's interesting. Next, the King of Pentacles reversed. Um, not a great card next, um, earth sign, so you could be dealing with someone who financially isn't doing very well, with the crown on the horn, it could be an ex-partner that's suffering financially as you succeed, and they're not very happy about it, um, they might be holding on to some money that, um, belongs to you, so it could be child support that's owed, something's owed, you know, there's money that's hidden or lost, or, um, but this person, this King of Pentacles, isn't happy. So maybe the sun could be illuminating um, what this person's doing or where this person's putting their money. Two of Swords, and, and a decision is going to have to be made. So this could be child support. In some countries, obviously, if you don't pay child support, you go to prison. So if this person isn't paying child support, it might not be that yet, but if it is, you know, someone might just come in and make a decision and take the money out of your account or arrest you. Let's have a look. The Chariot. Um, it's a card about movement, um, going forward, moving home, um, buying a new car. Hopefully this means, we'll see what else comes up, but um, I sort of get a feeling someone doesn't want to give you the money that they owe you. Um, but with the sun coming out and the chariot, especially like those two major cards, that I think that that's going to change this week. And the empress, well there we go. Three majors, look at you, look how well you look, look how good you look. You're the empress, you're the mother, you are... If you're not a single mom, you might be a business owner, but you're doing really well for yourself. And this King of Pentacles might not like it. If it isn't like an ex-partner that owes you child support, it could be someone in business that isn't doing that well and then sees you succeeding and wondering why. This pers person could be thinking, well, you know, how are they so, so successful and we do the same thing, but I'm struggling. So it could be about competition. Someone could be in competition with you and being quite jealous. <clears throat> Ten of Cups. Look how well you're doing. You're succeeding. Your family's succeeding. It could be, you know, there's two storylines here. Someone owes you child support. This is the family that you're trying to create, and someone's trying to block that because they're jealous of you. Um, the other story is, um, you know, someone's jealous of you in regards to a business because they do something very similar, and they can't understand how you're succeeding and they're not. So as long as no one tries to sabotage, we should be all right. But I sort of think those are the messages coming through, and if it's child support, you know, hopefully there's a decision being made this week where that money can go to you or they're going to make a decision where, you know, whether you've had to ask for a court to get involved or um, people that help with money. Um, there might be a decision made on what's going to happen because, you know, they, they might owe quite a bit of money. 
So let's see what crowns the card. The Tower. Wow. So one, two, three, four majors. So there's going to be an event happen um, out of the blue. Uh, you know, with the Ten of Cups here, I actually do think more and more it could be, you know, someone not wanting to pay child support and the Tower comes in for them. And finally, you either get your money, or if you don't get their money because they don't have it, they get into trouble for not paying you what you you rightfully owed. I mean, some people hold money because they want to be resentful and bitter towards an ex-partner, but that money's for the children. You know, living in this world, especially at this time, it's not easy. It costs. So if you're going to be that bitter and not give what you owe for your own children, you know, if a tower moment comes in, well, that's your problem. You know, if people are, um, what's the word for it, accommodating. If you don't have it straight away, you know, you can pay it off. But to give nothing, to just give nothing and sit there like, well, you know, I don't owe you anything and I'll be able to get away with it forever. You can't get away with shit like that forever. So, um, Earth Signs, if someone owes you child support, a tower's coming in for them this week. And you know what? They deserve it. They deserve it. You know, it's jealousy. Someone is probably bitter that you moved on to something bigger and better. But I actually feel too, looking at the Ten of Cups, um, you know, soon, very soon, you won't have to worry about that child support because you know what? Someone's coming in that wants to be a partner to you and also wants to be a parent or a substitute parent for your children. So, you know, I feel someone's coming in that wants to support you, love you, um, look after you. And that's quite old-fashioned because we're all independent with the Empress here. But um, it's nice to be loved. It's nice to be looked after every so often. It's nice to wake up and have someone make you a cup of tea or a cup of coffee and that you don't have to do it yourself. And someone's coming in that wants to do that. And they want to be a father figure or a mother figure to your children or child. And it might annoy this person, but they haven't been there. You know, hiding money so you don't have to pay for your own kids is, is ruthless. It's ruthless. It's not fair on the kids. It's just not fair. And this person probably doesn't even contact them anyway. So why are they bothered? You know, why are they bothered being bitter? Move on. So, um, Earth Signs, yeah, that's what I get. A tower moment for someone who won't do the right thing. So, Earth Signs, I picked up some Oracle cards for you just for some messages. So, the first one is, oh my gosh, look at this. The cards just don't lie. Children, your connection with children is part of your life's purpose. Absolutely. It's about child support. It's about money for your kids. It's about someone not doing the right thing. Not doing the decent thing. Well, you know what? Tower. You know, you might be able to think you can get away with it for a year or so. But as I said, in different countries, they arrest you. You go to jail in the States if you don't pay child support. So something's going to happen. You know, and, and also with this, I think your children, even though you might have difficulties with them sometimes because of their age, um, they they know what you've done for them and they know that you're there for them and they know that that parent isn't there for them so you know kids are not stupid what's the next one moderation everything in moderation whatever you do in life alcohol um, shopping work exercise you know I think this is about finding a balance I think this card is about finding balance and there's something that's off balance here. And it's probably um, the amount of work you're putting into being a parent compared to the other person. But, you know, you'll get rewarded for that. And, you know, go easy on yourself. It's not easy being a single parent. It's not easy um, looking after children, especially when you're financially doing it on your own. So moderation. Also, um, with this, maybe I, I just heard mediator so someone could come in and mediate this whole situation because you might need someone to come in that's that's not um, involved to help um, address what this person's doing okay so the next card is financial discipline Ooh, this is what it is it's about money it's about someone 
trying to hide money from you because they're bitter. So, you know, if you get a lump sum of money because it's owed to you in one bulk, be disciplined with that money. Put some aside. Don't spend all of it at once. Um, managing money. It's about sort of managing money, I think. And this is what this is about. And even if this person comes in too, um, they might be generously offering you, offering you lots of things, not just emotions, but finances. So it's just about maybe just being disciplined on what you will accept from others. Okay, so there we go, earth signs. If someone owes you child support and they won't pay, tower's coming in. I'm sure they've been warned many times to pay what they owe, and if they don't do it well, good luck. 